Hi everyone, Hello. we're in Mind, we're in the mountains. This is a really long ridge that apparently has some sweet thermals. We've never flown here before, it's quite nice, so we're gonna give it a go. Yeah. Hopefully we'll get some 360s in. In a lot of sync right now, the sync along like Aroo! I think I might get as far as that rock and turn back. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I'm hoping we can get some lift there. And in any case, oh, here we go. I just don't think I want to go much higher than that. I feel a bit nervous about airspace and just generally like how bumpy it is and weirdness. This video is sponsored by Grand Handling Retreats. Which is us. We've got great news. Our Grand Handling Retreats are back on and we're organizing now for spring 2022. We've been running these for two years now and uh, people seem to quite like them. Our retreats are small groups of four to six pilots. We go out every day. There's no takeoff pressure. So we just work on the ground handling skills and get you really up to date so that you can feel more confident in your takeoffs and landings. And we do lots of fun challenges as well, like sitting on chairs and stuff. But that comes on day four and five. Yeah. If you're interested, fill in the form and let me know which week you're interested in. And I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Coming in. Fucking hell, shit my pants. Oh, uh, finally down. That was really nice. <clears throat> it was amazing, but it was probably one of... I, I don't want to call it the scariest flight of my life because that makes it sound really dramatic. But it was it's, uneasy. I was uneasy the entire time and I was just saying to Andre I, when I first got down, I had to do the thing where I kept, kept having to remind myself to actually sit back in my seat and not be... like I was literally on the edge of my seat a lot Leaning of the time. Leaning forward. Like, <laughs> Like, yeah, it was a bit active for me. Yeah, we got really high. It was, there was lots of thermals. The thermals were big and, well, they weren't big and white, but they weren't like piddly bits. So it was actually really nice to, and, and I think you took off like 10 or 15 minutes before me. And you were like, as soon as I got in the air, she was on the radio going like, I already did my 360s. And, I did do a, th and she like was a high. 360 and I felt safe doing it. Cause I think a lot of the times I don't like doing 360s cause I yeah. feel like I'm turning towards the earth and then bam, towards the, the mountain yeah yeah um yeah but it wasn't too bad right because i was way above it because the wing was light the wind was light so it, it didn't push the thermals over too much so we could turn quite a few times before having a, to come against the rain there was we got one, really high though. yeah we did we did and uh, probably because of you because you were like let's go to there and then we'll get one and then we got in a thermal together we were following the ridge and there was loads of sink and we were getting lower and lower towards the ridge height rather than above and then I thought, if we turn back, we're going to be back going in back in again. the sink again and getting <laughs> even lower. But there was a really nice looking like pinnacle in front. 
Um, so we ended up pushing to that and actually it really worked. First yeah. I got some piddly bits, but you really found the core afterwards, probably by mistake. But the thing is, you like, turned Ooh. and I thought that you just got a little turn and we're going to go back. But I don't know whether you turned so that you didn't get too much higher above me and so that you could see me getting up. No, but I, I went in it afterwards and then stayed in it and you came back. Yeah, yeah. I, so. I was looking for the best places, but you found more than I did. So I just, I just either, if I'm in the best climb, I'll stay in it. If you're f going faster than me, then I'll just go and join you so that because that's going faster yeah. one of the reasons that i stopped being confident like after a while i thought i don't want to be in here anymore i want to go down I, um is when i was doing thermals one it was almost like the one big ones next to each other because i felt myself falling out of them but then getting another one straight away yeah they're multi-core they're not one big thing there's like yeah they're like the hot cross buns you know yeah one next to the other and i don't know whether you saw me but i did hot a really like quite a deep is it hot cross? White cross? Hot cross. It's hot cross, yeah. I'm sorry, quite deep. I did quite a deep uh, turn, but I started going like over and I felt like I was going to go over the back. What I mean is I, I, I turned really deep mm. and then it felt like it were almost taking me like a, like whipping me up like a tornado and it wanted to take me around again, but I was going further and further back and I thought, I'm going to end up in the lee here, what the hell? So I kind of tried to come out of it, but then did this weird like seesaw thing yeah, because yeah. it didn't want me to, because I was almost like banking too deep. Right. It was scary. I, I also <laughs> I also had uh, a few instances where I would I would do that. I would go like uh, thermal, thermal, thermal. So it's called staircasing, like thermal, thermal, thermal. Glide forward. You find another thermal, 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 thermal. Mm -hmm. Glide forward. So you're not like going following the same one all the way back because yeah. then you end up too far downwind but anyway it was really interesting Gemma landed after an hour I, Andre did like two I, I carried hours. on and managed to get quite high and quite in front so I think that probably worked out as like um, a triangle anyway hope you enjoyed it bit of a different one different place awesome I'm a big fan I think if it's not as rowdy, Gemma will be a fan as well. Yes. It's definitely good for space, right? It has loads I'm of space. I'm definitely a ridge saura, but I think it's just because I'm not used to this yet. But yeah. we'll see. But you like, but the, it's nice, the space, right? It's a straight oh ridge. Oh my God, so much. I hate being overcrowded. That's the thing that intimidates me the most. So this is great. So this is good. All right. Uh, thanks to all these lovely people for uh, supporting us. Thank you. Um, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. I'll see you on the next one. See you on the next one. Bye. Bye.